His face is starting to look like really square and boxy now. Zac Efron. They were talking about it yesterday in a plastic surgery blog. I was like, oh, that's Marissa's uh, platonic. Didn't you say he went on a date with like some random like waitress? He met her in Australia or he met her here? Oh. He was like uh, making a movie there or something? Have you seen what he looks like now though? Like super, like his face is just so big and square. I think it looks, he looks older than his age. But I think he didn't want to have like a baby face anymore. Do you know what I mean? He wanted to look more older, maybe more macho. He was tired of being the pretty boy. Or it could be the steroids too. Put away our DIY gel. Max, I want to thank you and your customer service team for a correcting my order today. Oh, that's awesome. That was Jennifer. Did you hear that, Ignacio? Yeah. She said thank you. Let's freeze her really quickly. Hi from Buffalo. We were just talking about Buffalo to uh, New York today, too, because that is where Niagara Falls is because I am already planning the class for New York. And they're like, oh, Marissa's like, I don't want to go to New York. She wants to go to Buffalo. Well, where do you want to go, Pittsburgh? What's in Pittsburgh? What about Connecticut? Anik is in Connecticut. What about Guam? Let's go to Guam. We can go to Yigo and Telefofo and all the magical places in the micro island nation in the Pacific where America starts its day. That's a long flight though, it's like 13 hours. Can you imagine being on a flight with your two kids for 13 hours? <laughs> You're like, let's give him some Benadryl. Oh my gosh, my mom was like, let's take Jasmine to Disneyland for your birthday. And I was like, let's not. Look at that, you guys. Oh, so stunning, the 5XL square. Aren't they beautiful? Hi, Max from Brazil. Obrigado de Brasil. Should we receive my order of nail stickers and more tomorrow? How exciting. You know, I love my nail stickers. I'm kind of, I kind of feel bad I'm not doing nail stickers today too. He ruined his looks. I agree. He really aged himself. You know, plastic surgery can age you or it can make you look better. I think for like, what's her name? Kylie? It aged her, but she looks good, but she also looks like a lot older than her age. Because how old is Kylie Jenner? Like 20 something? Yeah, she easily looks like she's like in her late 20s, early 30s. Oh, that C curve is no joke. She said, Question. Max the Amazing, Max the Magnificent. Sound like a magician. I'm using the Fantastic File in, what is this, 150 to shape up the 5XL square. Their color has faded into the nail, but what do you mean by that? 
Hola, the King of Nails, love from Ireland. Hi from Ireland. Love me some bewitched and some tatos. Make sure those sides are nice and straight. It could be your lamp too if your color is fading. Not your brand, but can it be all the sanitizer? It could be, that could affect the gel. Also like certain hand lotions affect how gel reacts as well too. Bonsoir Quebec, bonsoir. that shape you guys it is just stunning it was funny too because I got a message um, not a message like on my Google News feed it was talking about Arnold Schwarzenegger's son I was like geez that kid looks just like him the one he had with the nanny with the housekeeper how can Maria Shriver like Deny it for 13 years. She said, love my tato. So we're gonna blend in the cuticle. Let's use the Russian manicure drill bit set because this actually works really great at blending in the one, two, three, go. Wish I could function with longer nails. Don't we all? I can't function with nails, period, but I just love the look of long nails. It's so much fun. It's so glamorous. Can you put your nails in the camera more? They are in the camera, aren't they? Low speed too. I'm using the drill right now at 3,000 RPM. So beautiful. And this really helps erase like dry skin as well too. And by using it at a low speed, you literally, it's impossible to break the skin. Because it's almost like you're giving the skin and the nail a microdermabrasion for the blending. I had a little bit of DIY gel run, so I just want to blend that out. There we go.
Huh? Really? Uh huh. Oh, the clubbing. So like they're Care Bears now, like each Care Bear has a different like theme. The trolls are the same. Wow. Really? Is there like a, a, a disco troll? The funk? Is there folk? Wow, that was one for every season. Are you guys loving the 5XL nails? Like, aren't they everything? Right now what I'm doing is I'm just going in with the buffer, removing the shine so that way I can apply my gel to the phalanges. She said I wouldn't be able to do anything with them that long. But aren't they glamorous? You could scratch your sugar daddy's head. I like to take the smooth side of the purple buffer and just go along that cuticle as well too, just to make sure it's really, really HD finish. Stunning, stunning, stunning. Obsessed. Just sit and look beautiful with them, that's right. By the cabana, while the pool boy cleans. So, I removed all the dust. Maybe you should put them on and scratch my back. Massage. Beautiful. So, I'm going to do one finger on um, a glitter ombre and the rest I'm going to do solid glitter, okay? So I'm going to do glitter ombre on this one. So I'm going to use my probably my favorite nude. And it looks so much like our um, internal beige or acrylic. And this is pink press on, no, I'm sorry. This is A pink number three. halfway down the nail to begin the gradition or the ombre effect. Make sure that color is all the way to the back. Thin. Look at that color, you guys. Isn't it beautiful? Moving the 
excess. I'm gonna bake it for about just 10 seconds because I'm gonna do one more thin coat on top, okay? Do you have to remove the shine if you're gonna use regular nail polish? I would just make sure you have a great surface to everything for, um, for it to adhere on. Isn't this color beautiful, you guys? Like, legit, it looks like pink acrylic. We're gonna freeze it for 10 seconds. And we're going to use Maxi Magic Film Glue to adhere the glitters, you guys. I'm just so excited to show you this. We're gonna use Halo, and we're gonna use, of course, the bottom chick of bottom chicks, Miss Prisma. We're gonna take a little It's great to apply glitters to the nail with you guys. So take a nice, even, thin coat of Maxi Magic Foam Glue over the entire flange. Everything is nice and coated evenly. This one too, I forgot. Beautiful. Okay, now we're gonna bake four. 30 seconds inside the Dazzling Darling Lamp. We're gonna get our glitters ready. Halo is probably one of the first glitters that we developed here at EnoCouture.com. This is a bottom chick. It's been around for quite a while. And then of course Prisma, because you guys know I love Prisma. It is one of the most beautiful glitters ever. It is such a crushed up disco ball. It's beautiful. Hi from Michigan. So I got my little blender brush ready. Let's do, which one should we do on this one? Halo or Prisma? Let me know in the comments below. Which one should we do first? Prisma or glitter on the middle finger. Anyone? Are the comments working? I see one for Halo. I see both. Hi, Max. Hi, sweetie. I see two for Halo. Hello from Michigan, ring, Prisma, I need one more, two for Prisma. It's the middle finger after all, Halo. So Halo was the first one to have three. So Halo it is in the middle one. So tap into the glitter.
Wow, look at that. It is literally varnished onto the nail. And it's not like bulky or anything like that. It is super smooth, okay? So we'll do the pinky the same. So easy, right? Clean up our brush. Man, it looks like I was at a strip club. So much glitter. Now we're gonna go in with Prisma. And you really want to tap it on to the nail, okay? So that way you get a very, very smooth glitter application, but at the same time, it's very even. Not lovely. And this is the blender brush. Oh, I got the glitter stuck in here. And as you guys can see, there is like literally no right or wrong when you do this. It's all about having fun. How pretty that is. Do you love it? Like, isn't this effective yet so easy? She's like, you have inspired me. I try, thank you. So I'm gonna go back in with just a little bit of Halo. I'm gonna go over, and this is gonna help fill in any gaps and just give you a more heavy glitter look. It's 
so beautiful. Are all products available through online? That is uh, correct. We do have curbside pickup, but all the orders have to be placed online. And then once your order is ready, our team will let you know when you can come and pick it up and they'll take it to your car. So beautiful. I feel like a disco ball. Let's get a little hard light. For the fantasy. Look at that, you guys. So beautiful. So now we're going to seal with either shiny or wonder gel. I got my shiny ready. We need two coats. Isn't this fun and easy? Like, you guys could do this. Like, if you do this in the salon, I would do this, like, almost every day. Because it's just so fun and easy and effective. So the first coat of shiny, I'm gonna do it super thin and really rub it into the glitter. Why two coats? Because two coats will actually add volume to the glitter and just intensify the effect. and just make it look more sparkly actually. Cause it's like you take the glitter molecule and you put it under a magnifying glass. Beautiful, look at that. So let's bake this for 30 seconds because we're gonna do one more coat. Second coat of shiny. Love in the background music. Yes. There's our second coat of shiny. So remember you can do shiny or you can do wonder gel, but always two coats. And you can do wonder and shiny, shiny and wonder. 
it really doesn't um, make a difference. But two coats will give you a smoother result, most definitely. Everything is nice and coated and even. And that C curve is just so stunning, isn't it? Can you imagine if we would have sculpted these out of acrylic, how long that would have taken? And you can cut these down too. So if you want to wear them shorter, but you want to keep that really dramatic C curve, you most definitely can. down well wow, so beautiful let's bake it now for one minute is it still buffering for you guys? Let me know in the comments. few minutes uh oh that's really weird i wonder if it's my internet is it buffering for everyone or just a few people Ooh, it looks so cool inside the lamp too do you guys like these really simple but super efficient designs Take a 180, just touch up the sides really gently. Make sure everything is in its place. is what I call the Spanx on the nail.
you guys love it? Look at that C curve though. So iconic. Let's put a little bit of iconic candy cuticle oil. see like that glitter is like so smoothly applied like it's not standing up it's not giving me any snags or anything well oh, that hard light is no joke So pretty, very disco y. Let me turn off this one and see what it looks like just with. Oh, that's a normal room light. She's like, this set has just re reimagined everything. So stunning. Well, my loves, that's going to wrap it up for today's quick little demo. I hope you guys enjoyed this very sparkly 5XL square look. Stay safe. Stay out of trouble, you guys, because tomorrow Miss Mosey's coming in. And I will see you guys in the next live video. Bye, everybody.